Hi, welcome to Simply Jane's channel. If you're new to this channel, please consider subscribing for more tutorials on how to digitize our lives. Let's try to learn and grow every day. Write your questions on the comment box below so we can attempt your queries one-on-one. -on -one. For my avid subscribers, thank you so much for your continued support. I promise to level up our content to suit your needs. Please don't hesitate to ask questions, suggest topics that you'd like us to cover in our future presentations and discussions. If you've watched my tutorial on bills payment, you must have tried it already. Imagine the hassle-free way of paying our utility bills in the comfort of our homes. That's what we discussed in our previous video. Now it's time to level up. For today's episode, let us start doing a little investing. Hmm, but banks don't give us as much interest per annum anymore. I showed you that announcement made by one bank. So, what do we do? Why, here's Gcash in your palm, literally at your fingertips. But how does it work? It's actually very simple. It's a Gcash offers five investment portfolios all in one and the same mobile app that we use for paying our bills. Brilliant! Disclaimer lang po, hindi ako isang investment guru, ha? In fact, uh, I was just tinkering on my phone one day and I found the three dots. So, I clicked on it and then I discovered that G-Invest feature of our Gcash. So, ito po yung nangyari. Nakita po dito yung different funds that you need to, uh, you can invest on. And so, therefore, ito po meron, depende po yan sa risk appetite mo. And in fact, bago ka maging eligible to buy any of these uh, investment products, kailangan mo munang sagutin ang isang uh, questionnaire para malaman kung ano po yung investment or risk risk appetite mo. So, in my case, I was moderately conservative. <laughs> so, ibig mo sabihin, sobrang ingat ko po sa mga ganitong bagay. So, but anyway, I discovered, so, I tried to dip my tippy toes on the water as uh, we call it. At makita ko naman po, maganda pala. No? So, actually, I started out with 200 pesos. Tapos, nagulat pa ako, yung 200 ko, hindi agad-agad na i-post. So, alam ko, I sent already. Akala ko nga po, naloko ako eh. Pero actually, hindi naman po yun. Kasi ang sabi po, dun sa mga local funds, yung Philippine funds ay na uh, 50 pesos, pwede na. Pero I said, meron naman ako. So, I'll try 200 for this particular fund. So, uh, nag-start ako and then I saw that there was something. No, meron pong konting interest nung nag, ano na po, nag-flush na talaga. Na-record na siya yung asset na ha. <laughs> Napakalaki to, ha? <laughs> so, nakita ko po doon, may growth. No? At least may growth. So, tapos, I tried the high risk. Sabi ko, subukan ko nga po doon. Itong, itong medyo high risk. At doon po, high risk nga po, pero mas malaki. Ibig sabihin, mas profitable siya. So, kaya papakita ko po sa inyo, ha, yung sa akin. Ayan, tingnan nyo naman po yung stock market. O, up, down, up, down po yan. So, sabi nila, yung mga magagaling po mag-trade, so, pag nag-up na siya, magda-down na ulit. Tapos, up ka na naman, magda-down ka na naman. So, parang ganyan lang po yung kanyang uh, takbo, up, down, up, down. Pero minsan, okay, up din, eh, parang gambling, no? Pero, uh, you don't have to worry about your investment anymore if you put your money here in G-Invest. Kasi sila na po yung gagawa niya para sa'yo. So, unlike yung mga trading platforms, like mga yung Olymp, yung uh, mga bitcoins, bitcoins pa yung iba, yung mga cryptocurrency. So, kailangan medyo experienced ka dun. So, but here... Uh, Gcash made this really very simple. Kasi sila na po, meron na silang mga uh, managers, mga asset managers po ang tawag. Kasi ang may hawak po pala ng G-Invest na stocks 
ay actually yung ATRAM. Yung ATRAM naman po, yung ATR, Asset Management, ay napakagaling. Since 2016 pa sila, approved ng uh, Banko Sentral ng Pilipinas. So, license na license po sila. Pero hindi po katulad ng banko ang kanilang pagano. Kasi dito, uh, liquid po ang money mo. You can... Uh, put your money in and then you can take it out and then it's unlike the banks uh, mas malaki po ang interest mo dito pag inilagay mo lang siya sa uh, tamang uh, investment product so halimbawa pwede kang mag-invest dun sa mga international yung global feeder funds yun po imagine makakapag-invest ka na sa mga global companies gaya ng Samsung ng Uh, ano pa ba? Alphabet, Inter, Cree, yung Netflix, Amazon, IBM, yung lahat ng pa, yun, no? no? So, when in fact, kailangan yun malaking halaga, no? Kung sa banko ka pupunta. Pero with Gcash, it is made uh, investing really simple. At saka pwede sa mga tao, pa katulad natin, no? Mga simple lang na mga tao na... Uh, dati hindi kaya, ngayon po magiging abot kaya na. Imagine kung sa mga local investments naman, pwede ka na mag-start ng 50. Ang totoo lang, gusto lang ng GCash ay gagawin ng Pilipino na maging uh, tagapag-ipon. No? Mag-ipon, mag-ipon para tayo ay guminhawa ang buhay sa future. Ika nga po, sa pamilyang laging handa, walang sakuna. Pahiram lang po ah. <laughs>